So you're talking about an ordinance no, that's not constitutional. That that is so and the definition of camping, so camping is when you're recreating. Listen, that this is living. Not a court, I, am, I am enforcing the court ordinances set out by Ordinance the isn't law. Oh, ordinance you were isn't telling me that this law. is the law and you This is the law you it. have to follow, but it's not a law we have to follow. It, ordinance it, isn't voted. This wasn't voted on by the people, was it? Okay. Was so, this voted on by the people? Sir. Implied you were consent. You were defending this ordinance. I'm telling you that, that they have a right to be here because it's not included on this ordinance. You see where it says that they have to be if they're they can't be within a quarter mile of the arts. They can't be in a in a park after curfew. All those kind of things. They're not in any of that shit. Okay. This is a legal spot. Officer, so you you uh, uh, uh yeah officers. We've had, I'm more of an officer than you, you are. So is my grandfather. But let's Except for when I get complaints that you were harassing people yesterday. Oh, is that right? So look, yeah, can we at least right. just say intellectually consistent with what we're arguing about? Is that too much to ask? Uh, you mean where he said camping's illegal? No, when you're defending an ordinance one second and then when it's inconvenient for you, you turn around and don't defend it anymore. That doesn't make any sense. So I, you I, like when you guys lie to me? What am I lying to you about? You were harassing people yesterday. I had multiple complaints. That doesn't mean they were harassing people. Weren't harassing people. About them. his name. Okay. Were you here yesterday we were too? You were here? And we Who were the sergeants that were with y'all yesterday? There wasn't any Corporal, corporal that is coming to speak. Okay, so people don't always know the insignia, so I guess the corporal. How many corporals did y'all have yesterday? One. One. All right, so I'll talk to Latham. So people are going to just be all right. I think uh, I think anything you do here today is an illegal action. I call it, and consider this harassment, and everyone knows the lawyer's numbers, so you'll just end up in bad shape. Okay, that's fine. Have a good day. They were telling me everybody's got to leave immediately or some shit. Is that what they told y'all? They told us that, but they, we really ain't got no spots to go like that. Right. Yeah, the other ain't nowhere to go. That part. We got a whole a lot of them, them tents, places to feel. Well, you got to go talk to them before you just go over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know about it. All right, Latham. Latham? Yes, sir. Corporal Which? Latham. Corporal Latham. Awesome. Yes, sir. Awesome. Can I see your badge? Six, seven, nine, three. All right. Okay, flap your wings like a chicken. Six, seven, nine, three. All right. I told no one was told they had 24 hours yeah. to, to, to be out of here. Okay, okay. We're trying to get people out that's of here. That's what multiple people will... said. Okay, well, that's not true. Well, that's what they All right. said. So they're the liar, and you guys are telling me the truth. And I'm supposed to believe that after so, these you, guys tried you, to lie to me earlier. Why are y'all police lights on? Okay, we're out there every Why are your police lights on? So Why are y'all surrounding the, the camp? Police are here. They see you guys in uniform walking around. Yeah, but that way we can say if something happens, hey, we had our, our lights on as well to help people notify that, that we are the okay. law enforcement. Okay? Yeah. Hey, to scare people, intimidate people. We're not here to scare people. Well, that, or there's a lady anyone. in her tent scared to death. She hasn't been since yesterday since y'all showed it. She hasn't been able to do anything. She's basically in shutdown mode, you know, like, okay. you know what I mean? And that's and why we're out here trying to provide elderly, black, and disabled. I know exactly who you're talking about, yeah. and she is, was just fine yesterday. Yeah, Even how was she? I and just talked to her earlier. With us and she is wanting help. And that's yeah, what we're she's, trying she's to do. on the housing list. She's about to get yeah, housing. Y'all should just leave people, people alone until they get their housing. So city, the city council and the mayor said you guys are supposed to offer housing before we try to initiate any of these tickets. Okay, and that this is only a ticket. We do not have to offer housing. So this is only a ticket because it's a class C misdemeanor under the Freedom City Ordinance. So you can't arrest anybody. So if you want to give out tickets, I would love to have tickets. Just pile them up over here. Give me a ticket. Give us all a ticket. You're not, you're not tripping. You're not. I can set up a tent okay. right now. So just so I have know, a tent we're, we're right across services. the street. We talked with the prosecutor on both yeah. sides, municipal court and downtown Austin uh -huh. City Court. Housing. Uh, who they are going to be taking over all of the homeless issue tickets. Uh huh. Okay. We talked with them. We wanted we wanted to find out their opinion before we did anything. Yeah. You're okay. just saying you don't that. Have to agree you're with just it. using that. You I know what? You don't have you, to agree with Your it. commode at home is unsafe and, and creates a, a public safety issue. The public it's your isn't stuff. In my house. Well, they shouldn't be. You shouldn't be in somebody else's house. You're supposed to work for us. You should leave people alone. You're okay. going to have I, to figure. I understand you, so I like the opinion. purple bag system. I like voluntary cleanup. Moving people is going to get you sued in your personal capacity. Everybody else here. Okay. Absolutely. That's that's fine. No, it's not fine. It's not fine to break the law. We're not breaking the law. You sir. are breaking the law. Okay. I, you don't I have a warrant or a what lien. What can I do for you today? Get a warrant or leave. Uh, get all your get all your thugs Just out. Just like here. you say, you, you need don't a have warrant. To leave. We don't have to leave. I didn't okay. say I don't have to leave. I said y'all have to leave because you're harassing people and you have, have no leave. lawful authority okay. to so do is anything, anything else to anybody. Because nobody's time. breaking a law. Sleeping is not against the law. 
Okay, do you there sleep? Else that I can do for you? Do you sleep? Does your family sleep? All right, thank you, sir. Have a nice All day. Right. You should be ashamed of yourself. You all right? Well, they're trying to say the all gonna move like right now. Without a sweep truck, they're just gonna make y'all move. And if you don't, they're gonna give you a ticket. So great. Did you hear our little conversation? Yeah, it's not the best situation. I already told the, called the lawyers. Yeah, I filed complaints against him today already, Taylor. Other people have too. You doing all right? They're saying everybody's illegally camped, that it's unsafe, so based, that they're based off you guys are a public safety hazard. You're, you're, you're a safety hazard, health and safety hazard. Um, that's a good question. We should figure out what we're going to do. They're not going to let you move and come back, I don't think. I'm going to sit up my Motion to relax. And I need copy. I need pictures of everybody's tickets while I'm here. If anybody has old tickets from camping, but uh, yeah, maybe you can like, talk to people. People respect you, I think. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, yeah you kick some ass. <laughs> Lizardo Giganticus. Stop the sweep! Stop the sweep! Stop the sweep!